The Galaxy S24 Ultra has been leaked once again. Back in August, Ice Universe shared some additional details regarding the upcoming Galaxy S24 phones. This leaker correctly anticipated that all three models in the S24 series will sport LTPO panels. It's important to note that this new response speed is distinct from how frequently the screen refreshes its image. Ice Universe stated in a recent tweet that the speed at which the S24 series screens respond to touch has improved by over 10%. This means that when you touch the screen, it will react more smoothly and quickly. The touch sampling rate, or 240Hz for the Galaxy S23 series, is the frequency at which a screen recognizes touch input from a finger, pen, or any other touch tool. This means that the screen detects touch input 240 times per second. With an even greater touch sampling rate, the Galaxy S24 series will improve gaming by making it more responsive and fluid. It also means that the screen will react to user touches more precisely and quickly. Broadly speaking with a large leak that shared a lot of data about the soon-to-be-launched Galaxy S24 series we've now received a look of all the official cases Samsung wants to sell for this new flagship series. For those who are interested in the upcoming Galaxy S24 series, Samsung has launched a reservation scheme. Participants in this initiative, which is accessible in the nations where the Galaxy S24 will be available for pre-order on January 17, will be able to indicate their interest in the new flagship model by signing up early. They may also be eligible for extra rewards. In order to promote early interest in and reservations for their new smartphone series, Samsung is doing this. As always, let's take a closer look at the S24 series, covering its features, price, and appearance. A 6.2-inch 120Hz Dynamic AMOLED display with a resolution of 2340 by 1080 will be included with the basic Galaxy S24. For increased durability, it will include aluminum 2.0 reinforcement and Samsung's most recent M13 OED panels, which are protected by Gorilla Glass Victus 2. Finally, what are your thoughts about it? So with that been said let me know your thought in the comment below and if you are new here please subscribe peace out.